Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. I have been relaxing. I did paint my nails. This is actually a really old Formula X, but I pulled out a few pastels, so I think I'll be kind of cycling through those. I had like a mint one, a green one, and then like this really soft lavender. I'm ready for spring, and it says it's like 70 degrees right now, but I am still freezing. I've had a robe on, but I took it off because I didn't want to get my nail polish everywhere. I have definitely done some relaxing so far today. I watched, now <laughs> some people are probably going to think this is morbid, but I watched Outbreak and Contagion while I was, you know, answering emails and just honestly just trying to relax and take a breath and not feel like I was rushed to get everything done. I was researching some products. I was making some lists of things that I wanted to do and film and I need to gather up products for a video that I want to film. I actually want to film three videos today, maybe four. A couple of them are shorter, a couple of them are a little bit more in depth. So I'm gonna do a little bit of like prepping, but I would love to be able to start filming in about 30, 45 minutes. So a little bit of prep and then a shower. I clearly need a hair wash in. I still haven't washed my hair since the end of the last vlog. Um, that was only yesterday though. <laughs> I'm not like a nasty person. Um, but it's been it's been days. The dry shampoo is not really working at this point. It's like we're beyond that point. So that is the plan and I wanted to start this vlog with you guys but I got my FabFitFun box today. I also got one package from Beautylish and I'm gonna be incorporating a product from Beautylish into a video. Not paid, they just sent it to me but it's the Elizabeth Arden Provage Serum which I've heard really good things about even though I don't typically use Elizabeth Arden. That and the capsules, the little ceramide capsules are things that I have been curious about so I'm gonna give it a go we're gonna try it out but that's really it for now I really need to do some cleaning and I also need to deep clean some brushes like I do have my cinema secrets over there but I'm like oh my god I'm gonna go probably go through the rest of the bottle just trying to get like my favorite brushes prepped for filming but I don't know it may be an hour before I start filming but it's gonna be okay as long as there's a little light in here and it's not like completely dark I think we'll be all right I'm rambling this is not interesting at all so I'm gonna start pulling out my favorites to film with I've got a boohoo haul that I have been meaning to film since forever. So I'm going to hang those pieces up. We're going to get moving and I have a lot that I want to accomplish. So I better get started. And yeah, I will talk to you guys very soon. Well, I know you guys won't be able to see me. I just tried, <laughs> but I was about to go home on this lovely Thursday and edit another video and get it up for you guys, but I am stuck. Zach's coming because I, at the very least, have a flat tire, <laughs> but it made such a crazy noise that I'm like terrified that there's more going on. So he's meeting me. Luckily, I was only a few minutes away from home. I had to get off the interstate and I hate this, like I tried to get off this ramp so at least I was out of the way, but people just come flying through here. So anyway, um, we'll have to deal with this and figure out what's going on. I hope that it's just a tire um, and I can buy a couple of tires and be done, but knowing my luck, it could be much more than that. <laughs> so anyway, that's what's happening and I'll put another video up tomorrow, which you guys will have seen already, but please let it just be a tire, you know? Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, so I'm in my bathroom and I swear, I didn't think that I looked this crazy, but something is irritating my eyes right now. Hold on, my mom's texting me. Okay, so I have used my PMD. This is that personal micro abrasion device that I got. Oh, I thought I saw Paul, but I thought I would show you guys how it works. And the first time I used it, which I've only used it the one so far, I was like blown away because my skin looked really good afterwards. It's definitely a strong, a very strong um, like exfoliation. I just washed my face and I used the Bosha, the charcoal jelly ball cleanser, um, which I normally don't use unless I'm like breaking out or oily because it does make my skin kind of like, as you can see, it's kind of tight. Does that make sense? Like it's a little drier, but it's perfect for this because you really want your skin to be like super dry and ready for this. Mama sticks to me again. Okay. Anyway. So I thought I'd go ahead and do this. It's been probably like eight or nine days since I did it and you can do it once a week. So yeah, let's just get to it. 
It does have suction, but it also has this little like crystallized little piece in here that will actually like exfoliate really strongly. The suction will kind of pull your skin to the surface and create like extra blood flow. And this is supposed to basically make all your skin cells want to regenerate. Obviously it's going to exfoliate as well, which will let all your other products sink in. Look how dry. I need to drink more water right now. I didn't drink my liquid IV today. I think I'm dehydrated. So that's low. That's high. All right, so it's nothing too crazy. I'm still on a really like gentle piece in here. I don't know what to call this, but this attachment is like the training one because honestly, when I tried it out, I was like, ooh, that's pretty intense. So I'm, I just decided to use that one more time and get used to it. Um, and then I'll bump up to the next one, but super gentle. It's not super rough on the skin, but you can definitely tell that it's working. So I'm going to build up to the other ones, but the different like replacement attachments that I have get like rougher and rougher. So there'll be a stronger exfoliation. And now I'm going to do my skincare routine and then do some really intense hydration and stuff like that. So my skin will be ready to soak it up. And I think that's it for now. I have a video to edit. I honestly feel like taking a nap, like... <laughs> I'm really tired, but it's Saturday. I didn't even say that earlier. Um, I worked a short shift this morning and then came home. We ate some Subway. I filmed a quick video before we ate and now I just get to relax. I'm off tomorrow and yeah, I haven't had my appointment yet. A lot of you were like, I hope the results were good, but I haven't had my appointment yet. So at any rate, that's what's going on with me. I'm gonna do my skincare and relax and I hope you guys are doing really good. I don't know when you're seeing this, but there will definitely be already my BoxyCharm. It's the Fenty box. It's already live and there is a giveaway in that too if you would like to enter. So that's it for now and I will talk to you guys. Hey guys, so we're in line at Starbucks. Um, we really only need to get a few things at Target, but I haven't been in TJ Maxx in like <gasps> three weeks, I think. Well, maybe almost four weeks then. But anyway, we haven't been in a while, so I figured I'd look around and not really looking to buy a lot or anything but if i see any really good deals maybe pick something up and then need to get like some essentials toiletries and whatnot from target we are doing a one last day of eating complete garbage before we go back on keto so we're getting starbucks and i'm also getting a cheese danish because you know yolo what the fuck is this hair doing okay all right i'm wearing my rugrats hoodie it's got the rugrats on his sleeves Okay, so at any rate, Starbucks, TJ Maxx, and then Target, and I'll take you guys with us. I got some stuff from TJ Maxx that we didn't need. And now we are going to Target to spend more money that I shouldn't spend. Also, look at my little air freshener. It's 
vanilla. Who's naked? Little Joe. Yeah. We literally came to Target for like toiletries and necessities. Like, why is, why is this happening? But look at this. This is interesting. Scented. Oh my god, my nails and cuticles look awful. What is this? And look at all these elf sponges. I had a lot of elf in my favorites video, but this sponge looks really interesting. I'm tempted to grab this one. Look, and they're a hydrating camo concealer is so good. Love that one. Good range. Like, what happens when you come to Target that you just have to buy random things that you had no intention of buying? Really impressed with Elf lately. Also, I had these linked below. Seriously, satin. They're so 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 good. Three dollars. I mean, really. Are you serious? So good. Hey guys, so it is now Monday and it is time for me to get this video up. I have edited everything that I've vlogged so far. Sorry about that glare. Tina, hi Beansy. Um, I have edited everything I've vlogged so far, but I wanted to wrap this vlog up and show you a couple packages. I've basically gotten one every few days. Um, so the first one's from Influencer, and they sent me the Dior Capture Total Cell Energy Potent Super Potent Serum. And I think this is just like an updated version of their Capture Total line, but this is the Total Age Defying Intense Serum. Definitely cannot wait to try this. Obviously, Dior is a higher end skincare brand. So my only reservation with Dior in the past has been the fragrance, but I was actually looking at this lips, this lips, this list, and maybe it's just like really low on the list, but I can't seem to find it. Oh yeah. So it still has some fragrance in there, but it's definitely very low on the list. And I feel like before maybe it was a little bit higher, but I'll definitely be trying this and I will keep you guys updated if it's something that I like. And then the other two products I got are specifically for videos. So first the Elizabeth Arden Provage Advanced Aging, advanced, <laughs> nope, just, just anti-aging. I, I made that up. So I'll be using this really soon and you guys will see it. And again, I'll keep you updated. And then I have, oh, it didn't get me. And then I have this Ahava Mineral Mud Brightening and Hydrating. So I'm going to be using this. I'm going to film with this on Wednesday, I think. And I will definitely let you guys know. I think I'm going to do this in a video. But since it's a mask, we should be able to tell, you know, at least partially right away how it does but I'm really excited because I like a Hava. I've liked everything that I've tried from them in the past so I'm really excited to give that one a shot as well so yeah a few really good skincare items and now I'm just going to add this clip in and edit it and say hello to Miss Aminas hello Miss Aminas hey buddy oh my boy okay so that is it for now. I'm going to relax and I hope you guys enjoy the vlog and I will see you in my next video. Bye!